The story begins with two boys on the threshold of adulthood, the first is Julio and his family is middle class. The second Diego and his father will be a high-ranking political official. The film then opens with scenes of each boy having sex with his girlfriend. The last time before the girls left for a trip to Italy. Then they get bored after parting with their girlfriends quickly. And at the wedding they met Luisa Mirabel, the Spanish wife and in an attempt to impress the older woman they talked about an invented secluded beach called La Cadello. She initially refused their invitation to go there with them but changed her mind after. A phone call in which she confessed her lover's infidelity to her. And although Julio and Diego have no idea where to remember. The promised beach, the three set off for it as they drive through the poor rural areas of Mexico. And they spent time talking. About their relationships and past experiences. And Luisa talks about her relationship with the boys to a greater extent. She brags about it and Luisa speaks in more measured terms and mourns her first teenage love for which her lover died in an accident. During her stop at night she calls Jean. And she leaves a farewell message on his answering machine. Diego goes to her hotel room in search of shampoo, but finds her crying, during which the girl seduces him and has sex with her awkwardly but passionately. Julio sees this from the open doorway and Diego tells him that he had sex with his girlfriend. The next day. Luisa is trying to achieve. Tie up by having equally awkward sex with Julio. She then reveals that she had an affair with his friend Diego. And the boys start to fight until you threaten. Luisa leaves them. And by chance they find an isolated beach accidentally called Boa del. Gradually relax and have fun. At the beach with a local family. In the vicinity. Luisa makes one last phone call to Joe to say goodbye to him but finally that evening. Where the three drink excessively and recklessly joke about their sexual excesses. They reveal that the boys had sex. Frequent sex with the same women. The three then dance together. And then they retired to their room and began to undress and grope. Both boys are drunk with their attention focused on Luisa kneeling and stimulating them. They both gasp and kiss each other. With passion. And the next morning. Luisa gets up early and leaves the boys to wake up together naked. Then they immediately turn away. From each other. And they long to return home. The author explains that they did this. Quietly and quietly, but Luisa. I stayed back to explore the beaches. He also tells that the boys' girlfriends broke up with them. And they started dating other girls and stopped seeing each other. And in the last scene a chance meeting follows. A year later in 2000, a year in which. The Institutional Revolutionary Party lost. The first elections in 71 years, and they were having a routine cup of coffee. Together and following each other's lives and tell their friends. Diego tells Julio that Luisa died of cancer. A month after their trip and that she knew that she was sick all the time and that the three of them were together excusing themselves and never seeing each other again. The End Subscribe for more of these movies.